Hello again, Mr. RG Stuff here. Now on the bench I've got this uh, electrified hand crank gramophone which uh, sounds crazy but um, I did build this machine as a hand cranked one and then I slapped a motor on it because I could and uh, it does work a lot better actually with the motor. Um, now I did show this in a previous video but I've made some improvements. I've uh, stiffened up the motor mount quite considerably without uh, locking it down too tightly. I've also um, added a bracket here to stiffen it and um, I have made a, an adjustment round here with that, uh, that screw there. And there's a few other very minor things I've done as well. Um, on the tone arm I've uh, removed the tape and put screws in to um, stop it flopping about. Um, I've done quite a lot of work actually with the, uh, with the lift bit here. So it doesn't tilt this tone arm, at least it's not supposed to tilt, it sort of lifts up and down. And uh, there's a bit of weight on there, that's a bit of lead solder. Now, I'm not very happy with this arrangement. I think tilting would work a lot better, but um, I've stuck with it for the minute because um, that's how I built it. So I found a suitable record to play on it. And um, I'm going to try recording with my Zoom H1N microphone um, and, uh, and we'll see what it sounds like. Uh, first of all though, I'm going to do a speed test, um, so I'm just going to mount up the camera and uh, do that. So you can see it's not perfect, but um, it is coming out about 78. In fact, in a test that I did off camera, um, it did come out 78 three times in a row.
Okay, so I stopped it pretty promptly because uh, in a previous test um, it flew off the uh, the uh, groove at the end and uh, bounced across the label, which uh, was uh, exciting but not much fun really. Um, so there we go, um, a record played with this uh, this homebrew gramophone, complete with homebrew soundbox. Now I, I love making stuff like this and um, I'd happily sort of uh, modify it or play some more records. Um, let me know, uh, I can't afford uh, the space to just keep it uh, set up and ready to go. Um, it's using up half the workbench and the other half of the workbench is covered in junk. And uh, I have other videos that uh, I'd like to make uh, also. Anyway, uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please uh, like uh, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.